Hey guys, I literally just <clears throat> clicked the off button for the last episode, and now I'm doing another one. A Soulstorm episode with Necrons, with six licks, only seven. So, let's enter. Okay, so they whittled down the chaos a little bit. What's over here? Oh man, that army. I don't need the scarabs so much. Let's end turn one more time. Okay, so they, I wonder if, oh, he retreated. Okay, so let's attack there now. Okay, get all our regulars. Very good, very good. Third time. Guru Moon's Pass. I kind of like this one. Oh man, I remember losing this one so many times. My like for this one has suddenly dropped. <laughs> but I believe I know where they are. Both bases look good. I think it's down here. Nope, it's up here. It's up here. It's up here. Good thing not everybody ran towards it. Well, I mean ran towards it. I mean, they didn't all run down here. Okay, he's being upgraded as well. No, don't need a second one. But they're pretty much trapped. There's nowhere to run to. Just perfect to me. Man, something loud is going on outside. I'm not sure if you guys can hear that or not, but it's annoying. Wrong button. Very good, very good. Another one. Another one. Another one of that. Oh, what are you doing? Holes? Gotta take better control of my right now. What happened? Okay. Can't have it just sitting there uselessly. Already lost one. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm not too happy about that. There's nothing I can do about it right now, so.
Stop it. That's done, nice. Let's get that relic. Good. Get that. Ooh, nice. Not so nice. Hey, look, you don't need to be building over here. This guy. These guys are not doing anything. Oh my goodness, my ineptitude. something weird going on in the kitchen. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so... It might be 21, but I'll admit something to, to you guys. Uh... The dark has never been my friend. I'm not as... not really terrified of the dark, but I'm not as... I'm not that comfortable with it either. Anything can lurk in the dark. And what you don't know is typically what kills you. Um, I don't know what that noise was. It sounded like someone's going through the ice in my freezer. And there's no one out there. So. Um. My room is full. Now, I don't have guns. But I have a bunch of medieval weapons. Swords, axes, spiked maces. Uh, flails, shields, all that good stuff. And I took out one of my sharpest axes with me and I was not feeling good standing in the kitchen and looking at nothing being there. It felt like something was there just to fuck with me. That was... A feeling of... I don't feel very often, it's just scary. I got one um, headphone off my ear just in case I hear anything else going in that kitchen. I got the lights on there. And I'm not the only one that walked out there. My mom's cat came out there and, uh, my mom's not home. But my mom's cat came out there with me because he heard something. He moved out there before I did. So I'm not making shit up. I just, oh shit. I missed the strategic point. Oh, that's not like I need it. Wonder how often that's been there and I just completely miss it. Oh well, I'll get some builder scarabs. Commander, what do you need? Screw it. Adds to my fierceness. 
I'm gonna save this only because of the fact that if I get attacked oh sh crap if I get attacked and I don't feel like defending it because you don't need to see more than three defense auto resolve I won okay you don't get any points if you auto resolve either Let's attack the Chaos. I kind of like their base. It's kind of... They're they're pretty... They're actually a little difficult to move forward. I give them that. But they're not... They're not hard to defend my own base. Or they hard. They're just a little difficult to attack. Um... That's good. That bomb little just was good. ever uncovered, and little will ever be known of how the warp storm was unleashed on the Karava system's fourth habitable planet. Whether guardsmen there grew corrupt and turned to evil worship, or whether the storm took them unawares, is an open question. What is without doubt? is that at the storm's eye lay the lair of the Chaos Space Marines. And at the heart of this lair, a network of unholy and blood-stained shrines linked somehow inextricably to the storm itself. Although the lethal warp storm would flicker and squall here and there, ever shifting, a permanent conduit to the warp was maintained between these shrines. A charged field of immateria whirled there, certain death to any who had not given themselves over fully to chaos. In that radiant, deadly energy field, strange shapes could be seen dancing, screaming, howling. Any would-be conqueror of this unholy citadel would somehow have to dispel the chaos field that protected it. To enter it would be certain death, and while it stood... Nothing could reach the forces of chaos that lurked at its center. They come! They come! Yes, we feel them. They approach. Their blood shall flow at our feet. Blood for the blood god. Yes, we shall slake our thirst for death. For chaos. For death. Yes. They draw near. Let them come. The very ground. Will poison you. Demons will appear from the warp when your back is turned. And we shall lash out from every direction. That guy costs a relic. Shall be the cries of death and horror. <laughs> That's the ultimate beast or tank. The sound right of your doom will ring in your skull, in your soul. You shall tremble, and your blood shall be a gift to the blood god. Let them come. We are ready. <laughs> they are preparing to march to their doom. Okay, so we get the defense pretty much off the bat. They come in two directions, I believe.
but um, let's stroll forward and see if we can't just meet him in the center up here. At this point, that's why I'm just gonna defend my base. That's why I didn't try and get any of the defensive tactics. No, no. This skill is not going to Oh, I lost him already. Ooh, piece of crap. Okay. Well, let's get him up there. He is me. Because they're obviously not having a good time with it. And we got one point. Oh, oh. No. Oh, I'll be right back. Alright, guys, I'm back. I got some food. What the? I mean, nothing makes you more hungry than thinking some weird shit's going on in your kitchen. I expected harder resistance. Oh well, at least now we can build. Chicken leg. I don't want to understand why they just don't attack. Why aren't they going? Hmm. See, the, see those dots flashing? I'll show you in a second. these five points in order to destroy this um there are two boss homes you basically can't cheat at for necrons now what i mean by cheating is once you get that upgrade from the necron lord you change into the night uh he takes no damage and cannot be destroyed but he is on a time limit but he can deal large amounts of damage in melee form. <clears throat> Which means I can easily transport him and turn him to Nightbringer and still he can be going off to destroy a certain building that needs to be destroyed in order to win the battle. Unless you have to destroy a very small number of things. Which makes it exceedingly difficult for the Necron Lord to do himself. And... It takes an incredibly long time, but look, I'm very impatient just to wait consistently, like that. Now, when I said two, uh, the Dark Eldar, which will be the next and final person we fight, um, I believe we have to destroy their ultimate tank, which their leader is on it. Not the commander, but their real leader. And once it gets low in health, it goes directly to the center of the base and just keeps running around so you can't attack it. 
when there's a special warp there where if it has no buildings to run to, it'll just run there. It'll stay there. There's nowhere left to go. So. Plus, if, you know, if I were to do that with Necron Lord, it would be so incredibly difficult to defend my base. Got to find out why. I can't remember if they actually throw something substantial at me or not. I don't really think they do. No, no, no. I come over here. Very good. Rid of something core. Hmm. Takes down tanks. Vehicles in general. Nothing about warrior. Now, there's only two points where I'd actually build a second base. One is, of course, at the relic. And it's actually going to be up at the relic, like, right here. The other one, I'm guessing right here next to the slag deposit. But then I could also build one up here for a halfway point. Oh, no. That halfway point idea can not sound useless. Only because the road up there, right here, is cut off from this side, which I should be on. And the only entrance is down here, right next to their base. Oh, um, my units, if they walk right in there, they won't die immediately, but pretty much. They'll lose health incredibly drastically fast. And uh, what's the Necron Lord will say something about. I don't know, remember what he says, so. I'm sure it's along the lines of, don't go in there, dangerous, or something, but I want to hear exactly what he says. So I did upgrade all three. Good. They're upgraded to fully. That's a lot of health. That's a lot more health. I haven't eaten dinner. I pretty much came home and did this first, so I'm sorry if my eating bothers you while I'm doing this. Luckily, I only need one hand, which is the mouse hand for this. I like Minecraft. one 
one always stays up there to repair stuff. And this one's to follow the boat up. They do have a good amount of traps on here, I believe. And for each of these five statues I'll destroy, units come out of them to, like, avenge the statue or something. But I'm not sure if it's the placement of the statue that depends on the units or how many statues destroy depending on how strong the units are. We'll see. Next episode. Once I'm done building up this base, I'm going to stop the episode. Oh, I don't need the engine core for that. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, so I'm not going to use the flag tree. I'm going to use the Viol of Darkness plus the Nightmare Shroud. Uh, because they have melee units and they like to use them. I don't understand why a bunch of barely lifeless machines have gods. I mean, they're machines. Shouldn't they just not have any gods? They should be just like soulless and science-like, shouldn't they? They've got a lot out. That's good. Do I have one up there? No, I do not. Let's get a second one. And the reason he's out there is just for space to build stuff, as you can see. Don't need that anymore. I wonder if that needs to stay up just for the artifacts to work. That'll be interesting to try at some point. A little experiment. Hmm. Got a bone. And there we go. So. Everything else I build. Six. Okay. Everything else I build now will not be part of this army. And. I'll see you guys next time. On Soulstorm.